Hi guys, it's Katie from Crazy Maisie Creations. How are you? So I wanted to come live today because I want to make some basic candy cane um, door hangers today because I need to make them for my sh upcoming show. Let me pull up the live. And uh, I thought since I was down here doing them, I would bring you guys along with me. All right, where am I? Crazy Maisie Creations. So come on in, spread the love for me. I would appreciate it. Let me find the live, there we are. The love, the live, let's find the live. All right, I got it. Hey Cindy, hey Tina, hey Charlotte. What's going on, hey Heidi. All right. So I'm going to put that in. Those are my links. Let's pin that. That's pinned. Hey, Mary. How are you, Mary Sneed? What's going on, girl? I don't know what's going on with Facebook, but it wouldn't let me type anything in to say that I was going live, so I just had to go live. Hey, honey. Hey, Roxanne. Hey, Joanne. How are you? So if you guys wouldn't mind spreading the love for me, I would appreciate it. So, last Saturday, was it last Saturday or last Sunday, um, I gave away a swag bag to a lucky winner. And today, I feel like I'm giving it away again. So, I have a fabulous swag bag with some great things in there. Um, and here comes Maisie. It's about time. She's a little late. So, I'm figuring if we have, hey, May May, hey, baby, you want to say hi to everyone? Do you want to say hi? Okay. Oh, my big girl. Okay. Oh, thank you for the kissies. I don't know how she knows when I go live. She hears my voice on and she comes running down those stairs. Hey, May May. You going to say hi to everyone? Let's see. You may gotta look this way. They're over here. You wanna see what we're gonna make today? We are gonna make candy cane uh, designs. All right, there we go. Hey, Paula. Hey, Chris. Hey, Dawn. Thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Hey, honey, how are you? Say hi to everyone, May May. Say hi. Okay, we gotta spread the love. All right, let's see. Do you have a tickle in your ear? Mm -hmm. There we go, that's one. All right, are you done saying hi? <laughs> She's so cute. Are you done? Say hi to everyone. Oh my God, I love you. Okay, throw it down. All right, let's get this going. All right. All right. She is a nut job. And she's laying nice in her bed now. She's such a good girl. I'm just going to share this to a couple of places. So if you wouldn't mind doing the same thing, I would appreciate it. It's so quiet in my house. My mom is a little tired today. So she's taking a nap. She was going to go visit my dad. I think she's taking a nap now. But it is super quiet. Doodles is working. I don't know why I'm whispering. <laughs> uh, all right. One more place. 
then we can get started. There we go. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Hey, Debbie. Hey, Morel, how are you? No, we're not going to wrap Maisie up in a can of cane. No, no, no. So I, I bought a case of these. I always buy a case of these and the hearts whenever I can. So I have them for the next season. So I made a this. Now I have to make about 12 of these. 12 to 16 of them would make me happy. These are big sellers in my show. So um, I'm just making them nice, basic, easy. Uh, this bow I just made in the Crafty Club. If you guys have not joined the Crafty Club, please go over there and check it out. Crafty Club on Facebook. It's a free group. It doesn't cost a dime. In there, I show you how to make the Perfect Tail bow. Uh, we do exclusive kits every Friday at noontime. We come out, we launch our new kits. Melissa will be doing her kit sometime today. Uh, you get discounts that like my private group doesn't get. Um, so it's a fun, fun group. Go check it out. It's called Hey Jamie, Hey Jean Bunker. It's called the Crafty Club. Crafty Club. All right. So I'm just going to sit here and chit chat with you guys while I make some, um, some candy cane door hangers. If you guys wouldn't mind spreading the love for me, I would really appreciate it. Hey Yvonne, hey Dolores, hey Genevieve, hey Carol, how's my dad doing? My dad is doing okay. Um, he got released today from the hospital, so he's heading back to the nursing home, um, which is good. Um, so we're excited about that, but he's not there yet. I just called there to see if he got there yet. And he did not. All right. Let's all get nice, nice in there. All right. So let's pull the chair up. Maisie's there. All right. Good. But thank you for asking. I do appreciate that. It has been a long two weeks. Let me tell you. Him being in the hospital. So if you guys spread the love. Am I still live? I sure am. Do you see the live? If you see the red thing that says live then you know I'm live, okay? If you don't see that red thing that says live over my head, then you're watching the replay. Hey Karen, how are ya? But with her new pink jacket, Maisie makes perfect, she does. She definitely does. All right, so you guys, we're just using the basic candy cane um, ribbon. I was gonna use this as well, okay? But I have some of this left. This is from Costco last year. I'm going to use it. Um, and that's... Let me move these picks out of my way. I'm always at work when you go live. Well, welcome. I'm glad you're able to uh, come on. You guys, if you see... I don't use mini chat anymore. So if you see... Uh, if you touch my face anywhere, you'll see three dots come up. If you hit those three dots, you'll see it say um, alert notifications. Click that. So when I go live, you'll get notified that I'm live. Okay, since I'm not doing mini chat. Hey, Stacy, how are you? Thank you, Dawn. I appreciate that, girl. Thank you. All right. So let's get to designing. Oops, wait. I got a little glue on my mat, which is no bueno. All right. There we go. But it comes off easily, so don't fret. You guys, thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Maybe we can get like a nice amount of people in here today. I'll give away a few of my swag bags I have going on that are left over from my meet and greet. And there are some fun stuff in there, let me tell you. I know. And let me tell you, if you're doing craft shows, these are some great sellers. Even in your Etsy shop or Amazon handmade shop, put them in there. They're inexpensive to make and they're easy to ship. And they're easy to make. I mean, literally, you can bust these out so quickly. I mean, they are one of the easiest things to design. 
So my goal is to bust a few of these out today. Hey, Linda, how are you? So you guys, tell me how your day is. Tell me how the weather is, where you are, where you live. Have you guys started your Christmas shopping? Or are you still in uh, craft show mode? It's a great place to go when you, if you're not a vendor, or even if you are a vendor, to walk around and see what what vendors are out there to buy some gifts, some hand support your handmade local uh, people. I have a lot of my customers buy these door hangers, candy cane, and the Santa hats as gifts for their, you know, children if they, you know, just moved. Um, I had one person purchase it for their daughter's dorm door and her roommate, which is a great idea. Yes, Lori. So what happens is if you guys spread the love and we get to a number, I got to choose a number. Um, then like last week I gave away one swag bag, which was chock filled of fun stuff. Um, Today, I feel like giving away a swag bag or two. Wouldn't that be fun? All right, we got to put our little loop in here. If I go any further, we'll stop right there. All right, so I take a pipe cleaner. I um, cut it in half. You ready to go home? You ready to start the weekend? Hey, Charlotte, what's going on? 51 in my part of West Virginia. Hmm. It's about 50-something here. I mean, there's a, you know, a, a little breeze in the air, but it um, feels good here today. Sun is shining, so it's nice. So I'm just making my little door hanger right here. Snow is melting. Ugh, I don't say that bad four-letter word. I don't want to hear that four-letter word. Hey, Joy, how are you? Thank you, Dolores, for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Are you going to buy, are you going to the buy-in show New York in February? Lisa, what is that? Are you going to the buy-in? What's a buy-in show in New York in February? Don't know what that is. Hey, Jackie, how are you? You guys, thank you for spreading the love. I do appreciate it. I don't know what show you're talking about, Lisa. I need more info. Okay. Handmade products and supplies. Where in New York is it? I never. I didn't even hear about it. Is it a in? Well, I'm assuming it's in February, so it's an indoor show. Hey, Marsha from Oklahoma. Thank you, Joy. I appreciate it. Hey, Kathy. Thank you for blessing my page. I appreciate that. All right. We made the hook. So now we can continue. No, I wish I had snow. Roxanne, you're from California. You don't want snow. It's cold, it's wet, it's miserable. It looks pretty when it first falls, yes. But after that, nah, you don't want snow. You don't want snow. Hey, Connie, how are you? Hey, Sean from Edmonton, Alberta. Is that Canada? Yes. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> Mom's here. <laughs> I'm going. Mom's going. Did you get a call? No. Oh, okay. You're just going to chance it? Okay. Yeah. All right. Drive safe. Call me. You have your cell phone? Please tell me you have your cell phone. No, I don't. I'll go. Please. I don't want you. It's Friday. I want Please go get your cell phone. You want me to run up and get your cell phone? Do you guys mind if I run up and get my mom's cell phone because she's driving to go visit my dad? And God forbid something happens, like she gets a flat or something. 
It's about an hour away. I don't want her without her cell phone. So give me one moment. Talk amongst yourselves. Spread the love for me. Okay, don't leave, okay? All right, I'll be right back. Call me if you need me. Yeah. All right, see. Will do. Thank you. You're welcome, Mama. All right, guys, thank you. I appreciate that. I'm not taking anything up today. No, 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 no. I wouldn't. Okay. Hey, Lourdes. How are you? Hey, Kali. Let's go. You and Charlie are hysterical. Let me just tell you. I was watching Freestyle Friday today on Kali's page, and the two of them are riots. Yep, mom needs to be saved. So I'm always like, mom, you have your phone? And she'll like, sometimes she'll be like, oh yeah, it's in my pocket, you know? Or, no, I don't have it. Then we have to look for it. You know? Bye, mama. Drive safe. Remember, it's Friday, so you'll hit traffic coming home. I'll hit traffic going, too. Um, yeah, you probably will by now. Okay. All right, I'll talk to you later. We'll get the usual for you, okay? Yeah. Okay. So, Lisa, what is the thing in New York? Is it a craft show? What is it? So, my weekend plans are, Doodles is working today. He had to go into work. Usually, he works Sunday through um, Sunday through Thursday. So, usually, Fridays is our day for errands and everything. And we do our thing. We go way in at Weight Watchers. You know, um, but since he had to work today, and tomorrow is opening day, for deer hunting, rifle, um, or shotgun, whatever it is. Um, so I'm home tomorrow as well. And tomorrow my mom, she has a whole day with her friends. She gets her hair done, all that stuff. And um, so I'll be in the clubhouse. I'm just going to crank out designs. So today I wanted to crank out some of these candy canes. So I thought, why not go live? So I might be doing a few lives today and tomorrow. Hey, Raven from Texas. How are you? Thanks for watching. I appreciate that, girl. Thanks for coming on. Listen, if you guys have not liked or shared or follow my page, Crazy Maisy Creations, please do so. Please go over to my page. I would appreciate it. Every time you spread the love for a designer, you are actually helping us build our community. And uh, that's what I love about about this wreathing community. And it's really not just wreaths, really. It's really all kinds of crafts. I mean, you don't have to be a wreath maker to um, enjoy these things, you know. Enjoy making and designing. Tree went up November 1st. Good for you, Susan. Tree got to got put up this week oh awesome thank you mary for welcome mary girl i love you you are just i've missed you girl i gotta tell you honestly i have missed you did you see where that one lady but that rude remark about khalee's sister saying she sounds drunk people need to keep their remarks you know what no i didn't see it but they're just, you know, you're always going to get a hater somewhere. I don't even feed into it. I've had people make remarks about me and stuff. Listen, I want to see people that make those remarks, I want to see them get on a live and do what we do and make something. I mean, you got to be on a live. You got to chit chat, okay? Because you got to keep people, you know, um, you know, if you're boring, no one's going to want to watch you, you know? So, um... And then you got to make something, you got to read comments, you know, you, you got to do everything. People are just so ugly, seriously, so ugly. I just will never understand the ugliness and I don't even feed into it. Nope. 
don't even feed into it. So no, I did not see it. And I'm kind of glad I didn't. You're going shopping, Roxanne? What are you buying me, girl? You going shopping for your Elfster? So if you're part of my private group, we're having Elfsters. Last year we started this. And we have an Elfster party on a Zoom call in our private group. And today is the last day to participate. Hitting all the local craft shows. Debbie, you're smart. You can get some great Christmas gifts at craft shows. And at the same time, support your local vendors. Right? I'm all about that. Hey, Darlene. How are you? I'm good, Tisha. I'm good. Thanks for asking, girl. I can't see because I'm doing this backwards, but we're going to cut this right across there. Thank you guys for spreading the love. I appreciate it. I want to give away a swag bag. So if we can get the numbers up there today, because I'm going to be going live. I might be giving swag bags away all weekend. Um, I have a few of them left over. Well, more than a few. I actually bought 75 bags because I know I'm going to be doing another meet and greet in the future. And it was cheaper for me to buy more bags and less bags. So, um, my ribbon got all twisted. Um, so... Listen, I have swag bag galores, and I want to give some away because you guys deserve it. I, it's the time, you know, of giving back. Well, I always think it's the time to give back. And um, and I want to. And I know Facebook frowns upon it, you know, giving things away and everything. But I like giving away things. I do. I'm sorry. I like giving it away. So I'm going to as long as I can. My tree goes up the day after Black Friday because I always buy new ornaments. That's awesome, Roxanne. Hey, Connie McCormick, my girl. Did you make those uh, those uh, snackages? All right. So we have this on. I'm just going to put a little glue right over here in the corner. Okay. Hold it back over. Um, hey, Teresa, thank you for blessing the page. All right. Type in info for show in February. All right. It will come up for New York. You don't know the name of it? All right. I'll check it out. See what I can find. You just bought the stuff? Oh, awesome. You're going to love it. Love it. All right, look how simple these are to make. I mean, seriously. Thank you, Connie. I appreciate it. You get a present even if you're... Your, what was that? You get a present even if I'm not your secret. Aw, Roxanne, you're so sweet. You are so sweet. Hey, Holly. How are you, girl? Hey, Christina. Only here for a minute trying to get ready for an auction sale tonight. Oh, you have a sale tonight. Did you post that in the clubhouse? You guys, check out Connie's page. She's having an auction tonight. What time, Connie? Tell us all about it. Uh, Connie is from uh, Reeks by Connie M. Okay. She is one of my clubbies. All right, so there we have it. We have a little door hanger. All right. And you see this portion right here? You're not going to see that. Okay. We're going to cover that up with a bow. So let's make, here I got my easy bow maker right here. Let's make a bow, shall we? That's not what I want. I have one open already. Thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Hey Sarah, what's going on girl? This is what I want. And this can go back. Okay. Okay. There we go. 
I ordered a whole case of those frames before they ran out. Me too. And the hearts. Those heart frames. I make floating hearts. And actually, I just sold one a couple days ago. It's crazy because we're coming down towards the end of Christmas now. If you're in this business. Hey, Georgie. Hey, Lisa. And um, now I'm starting to sell Easter. I sold a wreath with an Easter butt on it the other day. I sold Valentine's. Um, so it's crazy. You know? Even though I'm still designing for Christmas, because I have custom orders and um, a couple more shows coming up. There we go. I had to find the front of it. Um... I, um, name of show is Retail Renaissance New York, now handmade show, February 1st at the, oh, really? No, I didn't know about that, Lisa. Thank you for letting me know. I'm going to check it out. Billy Joel, Joe. Hey, Billy Joe. Thank you for blessing my page. I appreciate it. I saw you saying Billy Joel. <laughs> I always wanted to try one of the candy cane reeds. Well, here you go, Raven. They're super, super easy. We're going to make a few of them because I need them for my show. I don't know how many candy canes I uh, pulled out, but uh, hey Ty, how are you? I'm good, Sarah. Thank you. 7 p.m. Eastern, Reads by Connie M. Yep, we only have two shows within driving distance in the summer here. After all, we only have two seasons, winter and road control. Oh, that is so funny. Melly Mel is having a pre-Friday sale at 9 p.m., 8 central, 6 p.m. Oh, my God, you are full of detail, Roxanne. Roxanne, I got you. So we have two clubbies having a sale tonight. Connie M., Reach by Connie, is having a sale at 7, right? Is that what she said? 7 p.m. Eastern. And then Melly Mel is having a Black Friday sale at 9 p.m. central. Is that what you said? Uh, Black 9 p.m. Eastern. Oh, okay. So 7 and 9. I got to share that. I got to spread the love on that. All right. For two of my clubbies. Okay. Yeah, um, in my area, I charge $25 with the ones with just about 28 if there's florals. That's good. Awesome. You know your area, so that's a good price point, you know? I mean, because it definitely, these cost definitely under 5 or $6 to make with a bow and the ribbon. Especially if you're using Costco ribbon or Sam's ribbon, which is what you should be using. I would not be using any high-end ribbon for this design. I always get nervous with these. Me too. I get nervous with live sales as well, Connie. I don't get nervous doing a live. I mean, this, I could chit-chat with you guys all day. All day, every day. But, um... You know, a live sale is different. All right, guys, so what number should we choose? Why am I blurry? I don't know, Irma. I should not be blurry. The home show is February 2nd to the 5th, and lifestyle show is February is also February. Well, I want to go to that. I'm working on the same. Oh, awesome, Ty. I always... Oh, great, I need help with a bows. Raven, that's... You know what? You know what helps with bows? Practice, girl. Practice, practice, practice. But if you join my private group, we have every Sunday, we have Fun Day Bow Sunday in there. And recently, we've been making bows, but making them for items for our craft shows. Hey, Sandra. Good, I'm not blurry. I don't know. You might need Windex to clean your screen. <laughs> Maybe that's it. Okay, all right, let's use this one. Thank you for spreading the love. All right, I'm gonna pick a number. Thank you, Tisha, I appreciate it. Oh, good, Stacy. I'm glad it's clear there. All right, um, let's choose, let's do, if we can get what do we have now? We have over 100. If we can get 200 people in the clubhouse, I'm going to give away a few um, a 
few swag bags. Okay? So you guys spread the love. And let's get let's give away some fabulous. They have signs in there. Stuff from Crafty Tessie, stuff from Trends and Gems, some greenery, stuff in there from a Lori Jacobs, hardworking mom. I have stuff in there. Um, we have stuff in there from Pam. Let's personalize it by Pam. There's a lot of good stuff in there. And then I added some stuff in the swag bags. Because, you know, you got to always add a few goodies in there. So if we can get 200 in the clubhouse right now, I'll give away a swag bag. Katie made a bow last night with the Pro Bow. I was so happy with the result. Oh, Ty, you got to post it, girl. Post it in the clubhouse. I want to see it. Swag bag, yep. Thank you, Julie. Aw, oh, thank you, Jan. I appreciate that, girl. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is really the time of day where I can get, um, like in the morning, I get orders out. I try to get all my orders together so doodles can pack them. Um, and uh, so when he gets home and we have dinner after that, he get, goes into the shipping and he starts packing orders. Um finished two custom orders this week. I have two more to do. Um, so I figured, you know what? I had a little bit of free time. All my orders this morning I woke up, got everything together. All the kits are together. Sign kits. I got signs out. Everything. So um, when he comes home, he can start packing them up and we can get them out. Um, and uh, I said, you know what? I got to get some candy cane frames and some Santa hats done. So, I'm working on the candy cane frames right now. And then, maybe tomorrow we'll do some Santa hats. Or, I gotta do some, I gotta do different things. I gotta shake it up a little. Um, thank you, Raven. I appreciate it. I've been making these for a couple of days, a whole case, for when I go to the market in a couple of weeks. I love doing them. We sell them for $20, $25, depending on the bow. Always Sam's Club ribbon, of course. People, yes, absolutely. So I sell mine if it's just um, Kirkland's or Sam's or BJ's ribbon, and just a simple bow like this with nothing else, no picks, nothing else in it. Then I sell them for thirty dollars at my show. Um, if um, I have more in here, then um, you know, depending on what's in there determines how I go. So it goes up in $5 increments. Okay. All right. Let's get a pipe cleaner. Awesome, Sarah. May I buy a swag bag from you? Oh, girl, I feel funny giving, um, making you buy a swag bag. Check back on replay. Got to go to work. Have fun at work. Thanks, Lisa, for letting me know about uh, the show in New York. I want to go to that. Hey, Holly. Thank you. Did I miss it? Is she giving away a swag bag? Pick me, bot. <laughs> I haven't given it away yet. It will be announced uh, either tonight or tomorrow. I always announce it. You'll see it posted on my page, the winner's name. All right. Ooh. There we go. Heavy D is getting heavier as I get older. Let me get my orange handy dandy pipe cleaner that I always use. Yes, 200 is the number, guys. What size are the bows you're using? What size are the bows you're using? Um, I started the biggest loop is six inches. Okay, and then I went down about an inch. Now, as everyone knows that follows me knows, I don't really measure. I've been doing it for so long. I just, you know, I eyeball it. Listen, if you do a seven inch loop, it's okay. If you do a five inch loop, it's okay. Okay. If I don't like how this bow looks on this candy cane, I'll make a new one. You know? So the bow that I have on that other candy cane is a per is a perfect tail bow. 
which I showed today in the Crafty Club using my Perfect Tails. It's a different bow than we did last week in there. I'm an assistant manager in school cafeteria. Um, I can't ever put a heart under the comments in a live. Am I the only one? Connie, I can't even share your lives when I'm sometimes on. I have to go out and go back in sometimes. Christina, uh, email me at crazymazycreation uh, crazy at gmail.com. I'm an assistant manager at school cafeteria, and I gave the candy canes as Christmas gifts. Oh, my God. Oh, that's awesome. They love them. That's awesome. What a great gift. They make great gifts. They really do. All right, so this, like, you saw me make this simple, simple bow. Honestly, if you guys are still doing craft fairs or you have shops and you have to fill up stuff for your shop, look, look how cute, right? Nice and simple. Simple, simple, simple. All right, let's get this sucker on. I know, I love the stripes. I was going to do burlap with it, but I don't know if I have enough. I had two rolls of burlap, but I don't know what happened to it. I just can't seem to find it. Thanks, Christina. That's one side through. Now you're not going to see this because the bow covers it. Okay. Now just make sure, which I didn't do there, make sure you go through the um, the rails. Okay, there we go. I did it there. Sorry. Pull as tight as you can and you're going to twist. Carrie, you haven't? I've been live. I was live uh, a couple times this week. All right, I'm going to cut the rest of the pipe cleaner off. And we're going to tuck it right back in underneath here. Diana, you have trouble with bows? Girl, you need to join my group to learn how to make bows. Every Sunday is a bow Sunday. Then we just pull the ribbon back down. And you don't see anything and it's covered okay and like I said you can add picks or whatever you want to this and we have our little door hanger here so it hangs nice and flush on the door and you want it to hang on an angle okay remember that you don't want it hanging straight up and down you want it hung like that like on an angle okay so let's just bust some of these out Just gets worse with every I know Facebook is wonky I, I don't really know I can't even explain about Facebook now I'm blurry what is going on with Facebook thank you all right let's do another one say my orange candy cane this one all right let's do Let's use, let's use this uh, candy cane stripe. If I had burlap, this is the burlap I have, but it's not enough. I wanted more burlap. And I know I have it somewhere. I just don't know where it is at this moment. You could do the pull-through method with this. You could do any method with this design these candy cane there's so many things to do but I'm just doing the basics I need some inexpensive items for my show and that's what we're doing now
Hey, Lourdes, thank you for spreading the love, guys. I appreciate it. If you guys want to win a swag bag, we got to get to 200. The most important thing about when you do these candy cane is your placement of your ribbon. You want the same amount of distance. for your ribbon. You see how you want the same approximate between each as you're stepping up or each layer. I don't know what you call it. Um, hey, Teresa. Thank you, Lord. As Bows are fun. My 12-year-old loves making them too. She's here helping me in my craft. Oh, Veronica, that's awesome. What's her name? Have you used zip ties to make a bow? Yes, I have. I prefer pipe cleaners. We all have our own preferences. Mine is definitely pipe cleaners or wire if I'm using Probo the hand. Um, I have used zip ties. It's just not my thing. I know a lot of designers that definitely use uh, zip, tie, zip ties and it works for them. Just, I don't know. It's just not my thing. Been watching you from the doctor's office. My 20-month-old is sick. Oh, Bethany, I'm so sorry to hear that. I'll keep her in my prayers. I hope she feels better. I'm currently working on three candy cane for my parents and a friend. Oh, that's awesome. See what happens? I start reading comments and I slow down. But I love being live with you guys. That's what Klee, yes, I know Klee uses zip ties. Yep, she sure does. And it works for her. I think that's awesome. You know, but like I said earlier, we all have our own thing, you know? And you, same with you, you'll tweak, you'll learn things, get inspired from designers. And before I forget, let's get a hook in. Um, and you'll just tweak it, make it your own. And that's what it's all about. That's what all these lives are about is you just getting inspired. Hey, Harless, how are you? I sent you a message through Messenger. Oh, okay, Sarah. Do you leave a little ribbon off the start? Yes, at the start and at the end. I do. Um, honestly, Deanna, the easiest and boast, the easiest and boast, listen to me, the easiest and best bow maker, I would say, probably your hands. They're the cheapest, the, you know, you make the best with them. Um, but if I had to choose an actual tool, I would say probably, um, See, that's tough. I like the uh, Easy Bow Maker because it's lightweight. And I like the Pro Bow. I like them both. I do. It's hard to pick one. I like the Easy Bow Maker because it's lightweight. It's kind of like the Perfect Tails. You can travel with them. So if you're going to a friend's house for a weekend or something, you just throw it in a bag. It's lightweight. The Pro Bow, I just feel that you can make so many different bows, full fat, fabulous bows, um, that, I mean, same with the Easy Bow Maker, you can do the same thing. Um, that's a hard one. What's my favorite bow? I mean, my hands are my favorite. If I ultimately had to choose, my hands are my favorite. But, if, if like, gun to my hand and I had to choose a tool... Oh, the Perfect Tails also. Do you see the Perfect Tails bow that we made today? I should show you. And the other day. Those are awesome as well. Um, I'm going to say... I'm going to say the Easy Bow Maker. <laughs> Hey, Cindy, how are you? Love being inspired by you. Hoping to rejoin the clubhouse by the first of the... Oh, Heidi, awesome. 
All of them are good, but just starting off, I'd say Easy Bow Maker. Yeah, it's less expensive and it's easy. It's lightweight, you know? I mean, you saw how easy I made that bow just before. If I had to use the Pro Bow, I mean, nothing wrong with the Pro Bow. I'm not talking bad about it, but you'd have to get the pegs. You know, it's a bigger board. You definitely, you know, you could travel with it, but you need a bigger suitcase. You know, there's a lot of ifs that go with it, you know? Hey, Sue, how are you? Hey, Pamela. I made 10 of these in the past two days. Want to learn to embellish them. All right, so we'll embellish this one, okay? Ooh, knock my head out. And so funny, guys, I do, like, every time I make one of these, it's always different, like, the way I do it. <laughs> Usually I'm holding the end of this candy cane. Now I'm, like, wrapping myself in the head with it. Hey, Linda Hobby Lobby. Hey, Clubby Hubby. How are you, CT? All right, there we go. We're almost done. You know what I'm short on? And I got to purchase it this weekend. Green ribbon. I never realized how short I was on green ribbon. You made your own easy bow maker? Good for you. That's awesome. What mesh do I use for the pull through method? Any mesh you want. You can use burlap. You could do um, mesh. I would typically use um, 10 inch. Thank you guys for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Katie, after watching you, I believe I can master this project bow and all. Yes, Sandra. That's what I love hearing. Simple, simple, simple. Okay, so I leave a little extra, like I said earlier. And we just fold it in. Okay. Thanks, guys, for spreading the love. I appreciate it. That's very kind of you. All right. Here we go, let's fold in this side. Hey Amanda, what's going on girl? Do you have an idea on how I could make a ribbon holder? I have six toast is ribbon. <laughs> That's funny, toast? Are you trying to say totes? Six totes? I had 25. And I was just saying to a friend this morning that I'm down to under three totes for Christmas. Yes! So excited. So excited. So make a ribbon holder. I mean, all you need is a block of wood, drill some holes in it, and get some dowels. You can get dowels from Hobby Lobby anywhere and just cut them. You know, Lowe's or Home Depot. You could definitely make a, a ribbon holder. Are you talking spool holder? Is that what you're talking about? Hey, Debbie, how are you? I made eight of these in one day. Very good craft filler. Yes, that's what I need, craft filler. I have all my my biggies, my bigums out. All right, let's make a bow. Let's put that over there. Let's get the easy bow maker once again. Um, hi from Kansas. Hey, Terry. Hey, Terry. You're a clubby. Uh, checking in between appointments at work. I love the Easy Bow Maker, but Pro Bow is my fave. I know it's hard to pick, right? So hard to pick. All right, let's make, um, let's 
since we have this out, let's use this. I like using the candy cane because it's a candy cane. So it's one of my faves to use. Now this striped ribbon came, where did I get this from? Burton and Burton? Yeah, Burton and Burton. Katie is a very thorough designer and I have been taught so much more. Oh, I didn't need, and what is wrong with my English? Linda Hobby Lobby, I love you girl. And you know you're in my prayers every day. Every day you are in my prayers. Oh, to hold your ribbon. Oh, all right. So I, all my everyday ribbon is in my room next door. And I have, um, I use clo uh, closet uh, shelving. Doodles put it up. It goes from one end of the wall to the other end of the wall. I have like six of them in there holding my everyday ribbon. I carry my seasonal ribbon in totes, in clear totes. So when I go up to my storage, I can see what I'm grabbing. I don't have to label anything like that. So if you go to um, Home Depot or Hop, um, Home Depot or Lowe's, um, you can get closet closet um, shelving. Why is it so? Is it because it's Friday? It's hard for me to talk. What is wrong with me? Thanks, Teresa. I just bought a ten shelf shoe rack that is good to hold lots of ribbon. Yeah. That's good too. But I these are just, you know, he bolted into the wall. Doodles did them. And I love them. Hey Tracy, how are you? Tracy! I emailed you, girl. About your doodle caddy. I need to know what you want on it. It's been sitting here ready to go, but you picked your paint and your vinyl. You didn't tell me in the notes what you wanted, girl. And I emailed you. I don't know. It might have went to a spam folder. Not quite sure. But I'm glad you came on. Oh, you're welcome, Pamela. So, guys, if you order a doodle caddy, okay, um... Make sure everyone picks the paint and the vinyl color that they want for their vinyl, okay? But a lot of people forget what they to write in the notes of what they want it to read, you know, the customization. So when you do so, please make sure when you order, you go to the notes section of um, your checkout and let me know what it is you want your Doodle Caddy to be customized, okay? And don't forget, if you are a Crafty Club member, there is a huge discount in there for my shop and Melissa's shop. Okay? So definitely, if you're looking to purchase the Doodle Caddy or the Perfect Tails, you know, and you're looking for them for the holidays, this is the time to order them. Okay? Christina, you're so funny. I've seen using gutter. Oh, yeah, I've seen the gutters to hold ribbons. Yes, I have seen that as well. Check out uh, Pinterest. They have some great ideas for ribbon to be held. Pinterest is always a great place to go when you're looking for ideas. But where did you get all this gorgeous red and white ribbon you're using? All right. This ribbon was last year Costco. All right. Um, this ribbon that we just made the candy cane is from Burton and Burton. This candy cane ribbon is this year Costco. Um, what else? Where's this is from? I want to say Hoblobs last year. You guys, thank you for spreading the love. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You will. This is like seven years of me being a wreath maker, you know, of just collecting ribbon and tools and stuff. This did not happen overnight, guys. 
I've been doing this for a long time. Um, I've only been live for about three years, two and a half years, three years, something like that. So, and you've seen me collect a lot of it while on these lives, but a lot of it also came before I went live. Oh, okay, awesome. I'm so happy you came on here, Tracy. Go to BJ's. BJ's has great ribbon as well. I got some BJ's ribbon. Definitely go to BJ's. And check out the ribbon there. If you have a membership there. I have a membership at Sam's and Costco. So I'm able to go to both. In the beginning, I only had a membership at um, Costco. My, I'm sorry, my security alarm go, is going off again today. This is the best alarm anyone could ever. Don't Please. Having Clancy and Maisie, they are my alarm. No one dare break into this house with them. Um, what was I saying? I don't know what I was saying. I lost my train of thought. When ordering a doodle caddy, can you put your own... Yes! Pamela, yes. This is just my name on it. But yes, absolutely. You pick the paint, you pick the vinyl, and you tell me what you want on it. You want your name on it? Do you want your business name on it? You want your website on it? You want your husband's name on it? Your kid's name on it? Uh, their school name on it, whatever you want on it, I'll customize it for you. So yes, you cut. I customize whatever you want on it. Absolutely. And I was saying earlier today, um, in the Crafty Club that I was saying earlier today in the Crafty Club that um, are you okay, Ma? Yeah. Okay. Uh, do you need me? No. Okay. Um, I was saying earlier in the Crafty Club that um, Melissa and I, Melissa is the creator of the Perfect Tales and the Doodle Cats. They're handmade, so they take time. The wood gets cut, sanded. Um, it, it's just, it's very time soon. And then we paint it, let it dry, paint it again. We put a couple coats on it. You know, it, it takes a while for these to get. So if you want them for Christmas, I would not wait. We're going to have a cutoff date for them. Okay, and we're already in the middle of um, November. So I would definitely, definitely, if you're planning on getting them, get them soon. Hey, Rosie, how are you? Hey, Donica. I'm literally watching you from my car on my lunch. Oh, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I did go to BJ's, but I'll have to go again because they didn't have a lot when I went. Oh, it was picked through. Hey, Joanne, can you tell me what the floating hearts is that you were talking about? Yes, in my private group last year, we made floating hearts. And um, it's a design I came up with. And I showed all my clubbies. Why is this all twisted? Um, so if you are part of my private group, you can definitely go check out the video from last year. We're going to be doing another floating heart coming up soon um, after we're done with the Christmas stuff. Um, and we're going to do a little different, a little different version of the floating hearts. Unless this mess sounds good. Absolutely. Absolutely. So if you're interested in joining Katie's Clubhouse, that's the name of my group, um, you could go to, um, the link is in the comments. We go live twice a week. We have a family Zoom call once a month. Okay. And that's where it's like a FaceTime where we get to network and meet each other and everything it's a lot of fun and um it's a good time a good good time all right so definitely check it out i know clancy mama came home i don't know why she's back but i'll find out after this live um, traffic maybe, I don't know. Um, wow, I'm very interested in one of them and the tails. Are either really expensive? Pamela, you can go check them out on our websites. Um, I don't know offhand, I mean, I know approximately the prices, but they're sold like in sets or individually. You know, you can definitely check them out. Go to crazymazycreation.com. Go to burlapboutique.com. I can put Melissa's, is Melissa on here? Oh, yeah, the elves are too. We have a Christmas party, a Zoom Christmas party every year um, as well. 
So if you guys are part of my clubhouse, um, today's the last day to sign up for the Elster. So make sure you've done that already, guys, okay? If any of you are on here. All right, so to purchase the perfect tails, I put the website in. There it is, perfect. Okay, so let's finish this bow, shall we? Yes, Katie. Sunday, can you show us how to make a bow using a pattern or writing on the ribbon? Absolutely, Jean, we sure can. We can go over that. See, this is what I love my private group for, you know? they If they want something done and I know how to do it, I definitely will show them. Like this past week, um, on Tuesday, one of my clubbies reached out to me and wanted me to do an evergreen pine with long ribbon tails and show how to integrate the ribbon tails into the pine, making it look natural. So that's what we did Tuesday night. Last Sunday, we did... For the past two months, we've been doing craft show items, but, you know, using bows with them, you know, so in, incorporating bows with, with craft show items. And this past week, someone wanted me to show them how to make a funky bow. Or was it a, did I make a funky bow or a terry bow? Honestly, I don't even remember. And um, where's my orange pipe cleaner? Um, right here, I put it away. Um, and we did that, you know, as one of our bows. Yes, fourteen ninety nine is what it is a month. And you get access to all the discounts. To And it's not just discounts from my group. We have more than just wreath makers in my design group. We have embellishment makers, Kathy Kirkland, and you get a discount from all her dolls and wreath embellishments and everything. We have Crafty Tessie. You get a discount from her. We have Burlap Boutique, Perfect Tales, Signs. We get a discount from her. Hobby Lobby, um, Hobby Lobby, Linda Hobby Lobby. For easels, you get a discount for her uh, from a Southern Flair. If you're looking for those easels, I own two of them. I'll be getting another one soon. Um, and it's a giveaway in one of my challenges. We've been giving away stuff for the last six months. And that challenge is coming to an end in December. We have one more month of a giveaway. And it's actually an easel from Linda Hobby. So that's November's prize. And then December is the grand prize. And then January, we're going to be starting a new challenge in the group. All right, so the group, we are like a family, honestly. I know a lot of people say that about their group, so we really are like a family. She is the queen of the hobbits. She sure is. Hey, Carol, how are you? I know, it's so cool. I have a lot of love-hate relationship with Pattern Ribbon. Oh, you're going to love it. You are going to love it. Oh, my God, I cannot wait for CT's house show. Well, then I must go to Costco. Gotta get that sheer... Yes, if they have it. I bought like four of them. I sent some to Melissa. All right, so this bow is going on. See how quick these are? I probably would have all these done if I wasn't chit-chatting with you guys and reading comments. So, guys, if you have not gone to my page to like, follow, or share, I would appreciate it if you did so. Okay, let's get this on here. All right. We'll put a few embellishments in here. I guess someone had mentioned they want to see how embellishments go in. Hey, Shari, how are you, girl? I'm doing so weird. No, no, girl. I didn't know you were asleep or quiet. You want to come up? Okay, let's see. Is that straight? So I have my mama. I have Maisie up in here. She's, Maisie's jumping up on the chair to sit with my mom. Walking away now. Now she's walking away. She always wants like you to pick her up, and as soon as you bend down to pick her up, she goes the other direction. That's why she's crazy. Okay, so I'm not a big fan of sheer ribbon, typically, but this I'm in love with. This candy cane ribbon, in love with. Yes. Oh, we're going to do it on a family Zoom call. That's right. 
Oh my God, CT, I cannot wait. Now, if you guys have heard me in the past refer to my clubby hubby, that is CT. I'm, he has been a clubby. He's one of the OGs. He's probably, I think he's the number two to join my group. He was number two to join my group. And he's an OG. And I got to meet him this past summer, him and Kevin. And um, I don't know, he has a special place in my heart, that CT. So he is my clubby hubby. And Doodles knows and Doodles approves. He's approved by Doodles. And actually, like today, CT reached out to me to remind me of posting something in the clubhouse. And that's what we do. We look out for each other, you know? All right. So there we go. There's that one. Okay? So let's embellish it. Embellish, embellish it real fast. Okay? I have some picks over here. Let me grab what I have. We can embellish it with some of these white ones. I have some of these. That's what I put in the other one. I have, ooh, let's do some greenery as well. Ooh, some branches. Can we do some branch? Oh, and I was just telling Melissa earlier today, I have an idea for Valentine's for a new wreath. Look how cute. I used this in a design this past week. I don't remember what I used it on, but it was for something. But I love these. So let's add some of these. Okay, so that's what we have. Um, where is the candy cane ribbon from? Just got on. PJ, um, this ribbon is from Burton and Burton, okay? And the rest is from Costco. Costco last year. This is um, Hoblobs last year. Candy cane, this is from Costco this year, okay? Awesome. Is all that ribbon, is all that ribbon you are making bows with two and a half inch? Yes. This one is a, all two and a half inch. This one is all two and a half inch. Yep. Okay. Okay, let's get some of these in here. I'm just going to put a nice amount of glue on here. Now, I'm not going to teach here because when I come on my private group, I don't teach, but I will show. Um, but if you want full explanations and details of things, that's what you get in my private group of how to do things, where to do things. I give out item numbers of the exact items I'm using. go. Where did you get the embellishment? Debbie, these came from, I want to say Michaels, I think. Either Michaels or Hoblobs. I want to make this one just a tad bit shorter. A little on the long side for me. better. Okay. So that's what we have so far with the green, with the um, white picks. Now I have some greenery here with some berries we can add. Okay. very quiet all of a sudden. I have never been made anything for any holiday other than Christmas, so I'm anxious to see other designs. Yes, Christina, we're going to be doing Valentine's soon and uh, Easter. We do St. Patrick's. I was just going to say, <laughs> Mama would not be happy if her daughter did not do St. Patrick's. And of course I do St. Patrick's. Uh, la, 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 la. Do I have any more cut? Let's see right here. Let's see. I'm going to cut this one right there. Okay. We do.
do all the holidays. Um, oh my God, I just hopped on. Where did you get that sheet candy cane wreath? Sheet candy cane wreath. What sheet candy cane wreath? I don't... You mean the door hanger? The candy cane door hanger? We just made it, girl. I so badly want to join, but don't get paid till Tuesday. Oh, girl. So join Tuesday, girl. We go live Tuesday night in the clubhouse. Yep. We would love to have you. We'd love to have you. All right, so we're just going to add some more greenery going around. I'm going to put some right down in here. Another piece. And don't be afraid to move things around. Okay, I'm not crazy about that one there. I need just one more white piece. And that would make my heart happy. There we go. And don't be afraid to break things apart. I'm going to actually move this one. There we go. And we're going to put this one in there. There we go. Nice, nice. We'll add some green. Just around the back. See, and you just do whatever's pleasing to your eye. That's how I design. So if I like something, there we go. And to set it just a little different, we can get one of these little balls. Here's my needle nose. And that's how I design. I just, what I'm feeling in the moment is how I design. I come up with a concept and then I just go from there. All right. And there we have it. We just embellished that bow. Can you see? Okay, so this one I would probably sell for 35 or 40, something like that, because of the embellishment. And this one I would sell for 30. Okay, you can see the difference of them? Plain, some loveliness. All right, those are our candy canes. Getting to say it closes today. No, no, it doesn't close today. So to join my group, you can join. I don't have an open and close. That's just for um, the Elfster. That's a little thing, our Christmas party that we do. So if you want to join and be a part of the Elfster, where it's a secret Santa thing, then yes, that closes today. Yep. Is the club cheaper if we pay for a year? Um, Christina, I don't have that option. We just pay monthly. Okay. Um, I guess if PayPal allows you to pay for a year... You can. Thanks, Pamela. I appreciate it. Thank you, Susan. Thank you, Sandra. All right, guys. Um, if you guys don't have any questions, I just wanted to come on here, show you, you know, I was not really show you. I just wanted to chit-chat with you while I made a few candy canes. I'm going to bust out a few more. And um, maybe I'll come live tonight. I mean, I didn't give away a swag bag. We didn't hit the number. Maybe we'll come on tonight, and let's see if we can hit that number and give away a swag bag. All right, guys? Um, what temp do you put your glue skillet on? All right. I started all the way. As soon as I start and I get in my craft room, it goes on to high. So it's 320, okay? As soon as everything is melted, I lower it back down to about 230, somewhere around there, okay? I like it a little on the thick side, okay? I don't like it when it's running. I like it a little more on the thick side. Alright guys, um, I'm going to continue to make these. I have, I brought three more out. That would be six. I want to try and get as many made as I can today. So, um, you're welcome, Shari. Anytime, girl. 
Awesome. Um, so if you have any questions, just reach out to me at crazymazycreation.com. I'd be more than happy to help you out. Um, and I'll see you soon, maybe tonight. All right, guys, happy Friday. Enjoy your weekend if I don't see you, all right? Talk to you later. Bye.